Hillary Clinton has been spotted loading onto a plane and traveling to Canada, only one day after a government judge requested the reviving of the email examination. Hillary and Bill will pay a visit to the nation, close by girl Chelsea and two grandchildren, living at an estate in Quebec, known as Manoir Hovey. Politico reports, U.S. local court Judge Amit Mehta decided that the State Department had not done what's needed to endeavor to find messages Clinton may have sent about the attack on the U.S. political compound on September 11, 2012, an assault that murdered four Americans, including the U.S. representative to Libya. Because of Freedom of Information Act asks for, State looked through the about 30,000 messages Clinton swung over to her previous organization at its demand in December 2014 after authorities hunting down Benghazi-related records acknowledged she had utilized an individual email account amid her four-year residency as secretary. State later looked countless messages gave over to the organization by three previous best helpers to Clinton, Huma Abden, Cheryl Mills, and Jake Sullivan. At long last. State looked through an accumulation of messages the FBI amassed when it was examining Clinton's utilization of the private record and server. On the whole, State discovered 348 Benghazi-related messages or reports that were sent to or from Clinton in a time of about five months after the assault. In any case, the moderate guard dog aggregate Judicial Watch contended that the hunt wasn't adequate in light of the fact that State never endeavored to scan its own frameworks for applicable messages in the official email records of Clinton's best helpers. In a 10-page administering issued Tuesday, Meta, an Obama representative, concurred. To date, State has sought just information assemblages starting from outside sources, Secretary Clinton, her previous associates, and the FBI. It has not, be that as it may, looked at the one records framework over which it has dependably had control and that is practically sure to contain some responsive records, the state.gov email server, made it composed. In the event that Secretary Clinton sent an email about Benghazi to Aden, Mills, or Sullivan at his or her state.gov email address, or on the off chance that one of them sent an email to Secretary Clinton utilizing his or her state.gov account, at that point State's server apparently would have caught and put away such an email. In this way, State has a commitment to look its own server for responsive records. Equity Department lawyers speaking to State contended that making them scan other representatives' records for Clinton's messages would set a terrible point of reference that would dwell on other FOIA seeks. Yet, Meta said the conditions encompassing Clinton's email spoken to a particular actuality pattern far-fetched to emerge later on. A focal introduce of Meta's decision is that the State Department's servers filed messages from Clinton's best helpers. In any case, it's uncertain that happened consistently or dependably. State Department authorities have said there was no standard, robotized chronicling of authority email amid Clinton's residency. A few authorities copied their letterboxes now and again and put documented message organizers on desktop PCs or servers, so State may even now have a few messages from the assistants, yet the FBI may as of now have obtained some of those messages amid its request. A State Department representative declined to remark on the judge's choice. A Justice Department representative stated, We are looking into the judge's opinion and request.